and welcome to a new vlog. I'm really excited because Corsica won't be our destination this time. We are on a very beautiful spot. We drove yesterday seven or eight hours to come here and we are in Italy now. But Italy won't be our final destination because we are driving through Slovenia to Croatia. Hello and hi from Croatia. We passed Slovenia and drove through Croatia today and we were on a grocery store and bought some things with kunas you pay with kunas here and now we are here next to the sea and i can't film downstairs because people are naked i'm not I don't like this Sun is green. Hi, on the second day, I didn't film so much today because it wasn't our day today, but that's okay. Um, we started on this beautiful place where I got some creamed and then I wanted to take a bath and I did it until here but then I saw some jellyfish so I went out of the water and after we were on a beach on two beaches but they weren't so beautiful they were rocks like big rocks and it wasn't very comfortable comfortable so we went on another beach where it was it was kind of dirt and not like sand or anything but we spent there a bit and Leroy wasn't very happy and now we found this really beautiful spot okay someone came and I was scared <laughs> that is someone from here who said we had to go but it was a German with his dogs just walking around and said we have a good place here <laughs> so everything's fine but that's the bad thing about wild camping because you never know if the police will come and send you away to the next morning we already drank coffee and Leo drank his chocolate milk and we thought about what we wanted to do here if we should heading to the south and hoping when we 
doing south to north there are less people because I think in one two weeks there are less tourists or if we should do like island hopping and hoping there are less people on the islands we decided to go on the islands and we are here waiting for the ferry now and <laughs> Leroy took a bus here because he said that's the beautiest piece he's seen here so far and it's 10 o'clock and I'm eating pasta because I was very hungry that's me and this is him The islands are called <coughs> Chris and Oi 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 Losing Some Germans gave us a little tip for a spot on this island here and it's amazing and we're just discovering what it has here we will stay overnight and it's amazing here I will show you the place after but I think I'm not going to tell where it is you always can write a message and I will tell you but this place doesn't exist on for Fortnite on or anything else so it's hidden <laughs> The camping this morning and are going to Kirk. The weather forecast wasn't so good for the day, so Lira looked for something we can do with bad weather. He found a last hotel to visit, but we didn't imagine such stunning pictures. We arrived at the last place, the Haludovo Palace Hotel. The luxury hotel was built in 1971 and 45 million US dollars were invested in this project. The Penthouse Adriatic Club Casino officially opened in 1972. Guests daily consumed 5 kilograms of caviar and 100 kilograms of hummer. For special occasions, the pool was filled with champagne. Maybe that's why they went bankrupt already the following year. During the Yugoslavia and Balkan War, 
the hotel was used as a shelter for refugees. In 1995, the hotel was privatized and went through several different owners. The hotel hosted its last guest in 2001. Since then, it decays and the nature overgrows. People took things with them, so the hotel looks dilapidated. Now it's a good known last place. You can enter to the hotel and look at everything. The swimming pools, the guest rooms, etc. But please be careful.